Hi hey guys, I got a new one for you. It's been hot today. I can't wait to use this. See you in a sec. Hi guys, I got another new shave for you today. Um, today we are doing Sterling Iced Pineapple. It was like 75 degrees today and I was out all day and we're used to it being freezing here. So I roasted, it was so hot. I'm still sweating in here and I just got out of the shower. Um, so we're going menthol. I got that and I got the Glacial Iced Menthol Splash Glacial. Super duper 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 cold. Um, I've got some extremely bougie spa water here. Um, scent tonight, and I'm going to bed right after this because it is like um, nine something here. This is way later than I planned on doing this, uh, but I've got a Blanc from Lacoste. Moisturizing gel. Lothar, Luther, Luther, Lothar. Some Tetra C from Medicaid will go on my face. Brush today. Beautiful Trotter handcrafts. I feel like it kind of goes whatever, whatever. Beautiful Trotter. Thank you, Paul. Um, and Paul, <laughs> I have. A package going out to you tomorrow. Sorry, it is a week late already. Um, Paul won on BBS Live, my second tub of uh, Bixby that I have. So he is getting that, um, and I will get that in the mail tomorrow. Weapon O Choice today, Carbon Plus Plus with a Voshkod. Uh, three days growth. I last shaved on Thursday. Today is Sunday. Um, and you can hear from the little clings and clangs that I am going to say cheers to you guys. That is the beauty of this little Glen Cairn like this. Beautiful sound. Bingo. I have a little, a little taste before bedtime while enjoying a nice shave. My hair looks crazy. Uh, please don't worry about it. Let's. Get going. Hope everyone had a great weekend. Been very busy here. We had Jackson's birthday party. Um, and then I spent all day today doing yard work. Um, we had our driveway re-graveled. Just been it's a lot of things have gone on in the last few days. Um, and I'm really excited to get into this. So let me get just a little water in this. And we'll get it going. Look how full this thing is, man. It's like a, was it 5.8 ounce pour, I think it is? Yeah, 5.8 ounces. That is so much soap. So much soap. I will never, ever get through this in my whole lifetime, I don't think. Um, but I'm going to enjoy it right now. So let's get into it. I will load as heavy as I can. So I may get through this soap in my lifetime, but likely it will be my grandkids. Uh, that finish off this tub. Just get into this. Once again, very busy weekend. Had a lot of family over from um, other parts of Maine and New Hampshire. Extremely happy to do that. It's great to be able to get everyone together at the same time. Um, just really nice, great family fellowship. Um, and it always, it always leave, leaves me feeling uh, full-hearted um, even when the weekend's over it's just so nice to have everyone together so fantastic weekend really really enjoyed it did some grilling tonight after um, after all of the lawn work um, which was great I did some burgers some dogs some sausages um, corn which I mean it's not corn, really, until it's southern corn in about uh, July or August. Then you get the real sweet corn um, instead of the stuff that is more like grain. I enjoyed it anyway. Butter, um, 
and salt makes everything better. Definitely have gotten some sun today. And honestly, it's been so busy, I'm kind of ready to go back to work. <laughs> no, a really great weekend. But even as busy as I've been all this time, I actually feel kind of rested. So that's fantastic. If you can be productive and then still feel rested at the end of the weekend, you've had a great weekend in my book. And I don't have a book, but I'm going to act like it and say my book. Fine. Mm, that is extremely bougie spot water. I can tell by the smell. It smells like it came out of a, a silver cylinder. I, you guys may not be able to tell, but I can. I know my extremely bougie spot water. You may not, but I do. Mm. I mean, it's iced pineapple, pineapple and uh, the scent is pineapple. I know you guys would never have guessed that. Hey, they pulled one over your eyes. It is actually pineapple scent. And it's really nice. It's really nice, a little sweet, super fruity. And then you got the menthol in there. It just really freshens it up. This is uh, Freshy Week on BBS Live, and I'm starting it out right. My scent is definitely a freshy. Um, iced pineapple is certainly a freshy. And I'm excited for this. So excited that I can't wait to go to sleep afterwards. I'm ready for a good snooze. Really great weekend though. I have my kids and a lot of their cousins and pseudo family, aunts, uncles. Aunts and uncles, sorry, I'm in Maine. Um, just, just a great time. A great, great time. This stuff will hold some good water, but is very tolerant. Um, you don't have to add a lot to get a good leather, but the more you do, the slicker it gets. And Sterling soap has always been known as a nice slick soap. So add some water. Don't be afraid to add water. Mm-hmm. And I haven't used Sterling in a bit. Oh, I just lost some leather. It's terrible. It's all falling down the brush. Once again, this is one of those that has a wide water tolerance. You don't have to add a ton to get a nice thick lather, um, but you certainly can and it will take it. And you know, I'll add some more. This one is like, it's not a low structure lather. Um, it is fluffy. But look, you can see there's a ton of lather because a ton of lather is a ton of water because it's about to fall off of my chin. Um, lots of shine there. I maybe don't push this as much as some of the stuff that I have that is a low structure lather. I feel like the lower structure lathers would just hold even more water. Um, But this is, I mean, this is very good. I mean, you're going to see how this works. There's like a ton of lather here. And I can keep adding it and I'll continue to get more lather, but I just don't need that much. All right. Let's get a little cleaned up. Good thing I'm going to bed after this because this shirt is getting a nice amount of lather on it. And I'm not going to shave my shirt this time. Sometimes I will, but I'm not going to do that tonight. So oh, here we go. We'll get with the grain here first. I know I'm changing it up. Sorry. I can't be the same every time. I have to change something up every now and then. 
And I, I know that was a huge change, but... All right. Let's get going. It's a great razor. A mild er blade, but I don't, I don't really call it mild. It's still quite sharp, but it's really, really smooth. And I enjoy it. I mean, um, razors that are um, not very efficient, razors that are quite efficient, it still performs well. I just showered and my face already feels a little bit dry from all the sun that I got. So I'm glad that my, um, that I have this post shave routine picked out. It should certainly help in that aspect. I really love this carbon razor. I think you guys know that. One of the best gifts I've ever been given. Thank you so much, Nate and Mel. It was their way of saying thank you for some of the things that I do, you know, for them, for, for their show. Um, and I do it because I believe in them. I love what they do for the community. I think they bring a lot of people together. And, you know, I'm, I'm proud to be associated with it. Obviously, I'm not, you know, it, it's not my, it's not my channel. It's not my live. Um, but I do take all of it personally. I feel like it is part of me, whether it is or not. I enjoy watching it. I enjoy giving on it. I'm very happy with what they've done for the community, which I already said. Um, and they're just, they're just good dudes. I enjoy their friendship. We ended up going live on um, Friday night. Like, totally impromptu. We were just uh, video chatting. And we're like, all right, we're going to take this to Instagram. Here, let's go. So we did. Some people joined. It was It was a fun time. We're just really genuine dudes. Very nice pass. And that's a lot of hair, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of that. It's getting cold too. This stuff, once you once you shave with um, one of their mentholed soaps, and then you add the menthol in the splash, it's like it's so cold. It's all it almost hurts. It's so cold for me, and I can handle a little menthol, but oh, right on my shirt. But it doesn't matter. Ah, uh, yeah, but it's just so cold. And then when I sleep, I always have a fan directly on me. It gets cold, but so fresh, so nice. I love it. Mm, it's a beautiful pineapple scent. It's not too sweet, uh, but it is It is slightly sweet. Um, it's just, I mean, it's just great. I love it. Rid of all that herb. 
Get that her out of there. Let's keep her going. I'm really going to try to not overshave here. But, on the other hand, we're starting a new week. I gotta start out good and smooth. And I'm gonna. Beautiful pineapple. Beautiful pineapple. That sun hit my neck a little bit. I feel like it may not take too much to overshave today. Whatever, whatever. Menthol is starting to really get in that skin now. She's getting cold, governor. I don't even know who the governor is, but it's somebody. Such a smooth shaver. If you don't have this one and, you know, you can, you feel like you, you're okay dropping some money. Um, awesome. There's a titanium version now. You, you don't have to have titanium. I'm going to say if they were more economical, I might think about it, but I'm not, I'm not paying that much for a DE, just not straight. Yeah. If it's something custom made, yes, but I just can't, can't make myself spend that for a DE. Lots of people can and hey, good for them. Absolutely. If I could justify it, I would have one. I couldn't justify this razor, but thank God for some good friends. I get high with a little help from my friends. Sorry. Mm, just getting cold. When this water hits, it gets even colder. Just keep working it, you'll get more lather. See, it's multiplying. I got lather, it's multiplying. And I promise not to sing anymore. But I still might, even though I said I wouldn't. I might. Look, we worked quite a bit more lather just by adding water. Don't be scared to add water. All right, let's keep her going. Let's get done so I can go to bed.
This is a great way to wind down for me, though. Nice shave. Got some nice menthol here. Gonna get nice and cool. I love going to sleep with a fan on my face. And here to add this cooling effect also. Man, it's gonna be perfect. Perfect. I have a nice soft face. No stubble, cold. Hey man, that's 70 degree weather. That'll burn you up. I just don't know how I lived in West Tennessee now, seeing the, you know, the, the very lack of heat tolerance that I have now. I would sweat to death there. 70 hits here, and I'm like, we're we'll going to have to get the air conditioners in. And that will be happening this week. We have window units up here. We don't have central air. I mean, you could get it, but you only have just a few months that you can use it. And Window units kind of be the way to go here. Mm. Very good. Boy, my hair looks bad. Add some water to it. Anything to make it look better than that. There we go. All right. And I'm just going to take this off of here and just kind of feel, feel what we got. Got myself right there. Um, I had, I don't know if it's ingrown hair or what, but one here and one um, here. And I really thought this one was going to come out, but it hasn't yet. Let's see if I can get that done. <laughs> See if I can overshave until I get it. This splash is very high alcohol too. So, um, you know, if I overshave and need to bleed, that alcohol will bring it out, I promise you. Good thing is I just let it heal overnight. And then I'll take a shower in the morning and do some really nice moisturizing and all will be good. And once again, I got some sun on my face today, so I'm not gonna go crazy here. However, this feels like a very nice shave. I don't really need to do a bunch of anything that's fantastic we're, we're good mm. another fantastic shave i mean economy and performance it is hard to beat sterling very slick always gives me a nice shave um and i, I think this set you know soap and aftershave is like i mean it's like 25 bucks together that's hard to beat. Really good stuff and really nice people too. And they make one incredibly efficient slash aggressive razor. I, I don't call it aggressive. That one might be aggressive. The, uh, I mean, they do call it the hyper-aggressive, so I guess it's okay. All right, cold water. Whew, that's cold. Holy moly. I feel like I'm doing a polar dip. Yeah.
I mean, I like cold. Whew. All right, so I haven't been doing this, but I can feel some irritation down there. Not from any of the stuff that I use, but, you know, I got some real sun on my face today. So I'm actually going to use an Allen block here just to kind of seal off my neck. Whew. Well, not going to use it anymore. <laughs> She done broke it. I knew it was going to happen pretty soon. It was getting smaller. Well, here, whatever. <laughs> I've never been through a whole Allen block because once they get a little smaller, um, I drop them and I break them. And they get finished on my floor like this one just did. Good thing they're cheap. And I really mostly just use them for grip now. So I can, you know, either tug on my skin or just to get grip on a razor. All right. I think broke into a million pieces. I'm going to be up a little bit longer than I expected today. All right, I'm going to throw this away while it's working. And kind of clean my brush out a little bit. Get some water into there. While this alum does its stuff, really, really nice soap. Just, that's very nice. And the fact that they, you know, don't raise their prices is just, that's crazy. And really nice people in the community. Got it washed out. Really nice trotter brush. upside down for a couple days and let's go to cold water again and get this alum off. It's cold. It's about to get colder. I really like this, um, the Sterling Splash. It's just, you know, there's not a huge amount of stuff going on in there. It is, um, oh, they got, I don't think they had witch hazel in there before. Uh, denatured alcohol, witch hazel, fragrance oil, aloe, menthol, glycerin, hydrovans. So I think there's a little more in there now than there used to be, or I just don't remember. I could be. I do suffer from CRS. Can't remember stuff. All right, here we go. Come on, menthol. Mm -hmm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's cold stuff. Mmm. Yep, that is glacial. Whew. That's cold, guys. I know there are a lot of menthol heads out there. I'm, I'm not, I won't call myself a menthol head, but I can handle some menthol. That's cold. I mean, it's, it's one thing cold anyway, if you just use it, but once you pair it with the soap as well, I mean, you've already got this base layer of, of cold, and then you just add this uh, frigid ice to the top of it. It's cold. All right. Woo. Um, Tetra C. Medicate. Get that good stuff into the face. 
before bedtime. Whew, man, that menthol. Good stuff right here. I'm really enjoying this stuff. Really light oil that it's in. Um, meadow foam? Um, I have to look. I don't know if it's on the bottle or not. All right, I'll let this kind of soak in, and I'll see if the see if the oil delivery method is on there. It is. No, it was on the carton. I don't have the carton anymore. Sorry. I feel like it's meadow foam oil, though. It's a, a really light oil, so it doesn't, you know, it doesn't feel greasy, oily on the face. Um, it soaks in very well. All right, we'll get rid of that. And then this stuff is very good. I just, I could tell you how good it is, but I'm not going to, except that it is really good. And that's, that's all I'm going to tell you. I'm not going to tell you how really good it is, but it's just really good. Like, like really good. No, I love it. It is kind of light to go on the face. Uh, super moisturizing. And it soaks in really quickly as well. Just really, really good stuff. It's so moisturizing that I'm not sure how it's going to do in the summer when it's really warm, uh, but we'll see. Um, I hope that it's not too much. If it is, you know, obviously I'll go with something even lighter during the summer and then get back to this when it starts to get colder. But for right now, it is, I mean, it is great. It is very, very nice stuff. All right, and let's finish with a little scent. Got some grapefruit in here, some bergamot, um, you know, citrusy, a little, um, a little aquatic. It's just nice. And now I have some good scent to sleep in. Thank you guys for, so much for joining me. I've still got another new one. We've got um, a McDuff's coming up, Spring Cabin. So I still have to do that one. But thank you guys. Whew. And menthol is still getting my eyes. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you have a fabulous week. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace.